and welcome to today's episode of L360. Today we're shedding light on a health topic that affects millions of women worldwide. The polycystic ovary syndrome, popularly known as PCOS. Yes. And in this episode, we'll be discussing in details what it entails. I am Blessing Oduni, and with me is my co-host. I am Solomon Ededo. Thank you for joining us today. PCOS, you know, is is a situation that is often mm-hmm. misunderstood and even underdiagnosed. Yeah. Data available worldwide shows that it affects. 8% between 8% and 13% of women globally and even data available in Nigeria shows that one in every 10 women is suffering from, from PCOS. PCOS and the funny thing is this data is underdiagnosed so you can imagine what the actual data the, is yeah. in its full diagnosis and it all and a few questions I feel we need to ask ourselves is what is PCOS and why does it affect women in the reproductive age? You know, PCOS is a hormonal imbalance situation, but this time is the imbalance is in the area of reproductive hormones. So this affects the uh, uterus and often leads to issues um, relating to um, infertility, um, sometimes mental stress like anxiety, depression and all. And you know, looking at the kind of people it affects, those within the reproductive age, it is because it actually involves reproductive hormones and that's why. And one we often wonder, is there a solution? Can this be cured? Yeah. What can we do? Okay, so absolutely, that's, that's actually very, very profound. I feel like you've just lectured us on a whole PCOS episode. <laughs> Thank you for that, it was profound. But I'd like to also state that PCOS could lead to regular menstrual cycles. Yeah. So for ladies out there that sometimes are wondering why they have um, irregular regular cycles, cycle. menstrual cycles, it could be PCOS. So do well to visit the hospital. However, Confirm. there is no cure for PCOS. But the good news is that it can be managed effectively. And then this can be done through lifestyle changes. So lifestyle changes such as regular exercise, weight management, taking balanced diet. Diet, You know, on this, on every episode of F360, we always lay emphasis on how lifestyle changes Changes can can play a great role in our health, in the quality of our health, in avoiding diagnosis or diseases such as this. So this is one way which we could manage this effectively. Also, healthcare professionals could also prescribe medications such as insulin sensitization drugs mm. or um, we could talk about hormonal birth control yeah, medications yes. and also these are ways in which it could be managed effectively. And, and one other thing as we wrap up is for us to understand that it's very, very important that we quickly identify this early detection and, early detection and be true. able to manage it because failure to detect it early will mean it will have gone a stage mm-hmm. two stages ahead of you know treatment so the earlier we um detect it the better. the better for us and also it is important that you know we assess care and support and one thing about pcos is the support is individually tailor-made so mm-hmm. if if um, the way you will need it is different from the way another the person, person will need it. So it's unique. So it's very important that, you know, early detection and also unique tailor-made uh, support system for individuals with it. Of course, we cannot, we, ca- we would always lay emphasis on the importance of community, coming together and do not stigmatize anyone you perceive as yeah. being diagnosed of PCOS because mm-hmm. it is a condition that could get women thinking and be the first. So do well to encourage them, support them in the way you can and even share this video with them. We've come to the end of this episode and we know that you found this very profound. So do well to share with your friends, your family and loved ones. Also leave beautiful comments. If you have questions, you could also leave it in the comment section. We do well to reply and answer. Thank you so much for joining us on this episode of L360 where we discuss all topics that matters the most to you. I am blessing all doing me. And I am Solomon Adedo saying thank you. Until next time, bye.